Hi, this is Kevin. Today we talk about Epson's built-in printhead cleaning function. Many of you cannot get uh, the printer to print after receiving it, or maybe you were using it for for a while, and then uh, someday you just find the color is missing. You run the printer's self-cleaning function again and again, and just cannot get it work. We're gonna use this brand new printer as example. So let's check a couple of things first. Uh, first, we check the ink supply. Make sure the, the small plug, they are unplugged. They should be plugged only if you are, you are doing the shipping, but uh, in the normal use, you should unplug it. And uh, if you look underneath the tanks, you're gonna see tubes. Make sure there's no kinks in the tube, especially the yellow color. Uh, the reason I'm saying yellow is, if this is at a really weird angle, when you close, it will create a kink. Uh, you can just use your finger to change the direction a little bit, so you don't have. So just make sure you don't have kinks. Okay, all those I make sure there's no no kinks on the tube, and uh, for the black, make sure the black is not bending because the black have the sharpest curve. To go in, each one have a large tube on the bottom which goes to print that, and each one has a small tube from the printer. You can see each box has an air on the top. That air is the direction of the ink flow. So the ink will flow from the tank, which is a smaller tube, to the larger to the larger tube. So if your larger tube is bent like this and you have to readjust it and make it get it corrected. You can see the large tube is full of air. Uh, this is especially true after the shipping, uh, which the printer dumps out of the ink during the, ship, during the shipment. So our next goal is, is to fill those empty tubes with ink. We're going to use absence building functions to clean the printhead. The clean uh, print head function has uh, three uh, methods. One is it's going to shake the the print head. Second one is going to use uh, a rubber wiper to wipe the print head. Uh, here's here's the rubber wiper. I just go back and forth to wipe the bottom of the print head clean. Uh, neither of those two functions are relevant to us. Um, what we need is a third function. The third function is uh, using this rubber little chamber to suck ink out of the printhead. Unfortunately, apps not always run the third function, so, so you probably will do a lot of cleanings to get a good nozzle check. So we get this new printer here. Let's see how many cleanings we can trigger uh, ink sucking that we can fill those uh, white tubes with ink, and how many cleanings and two we can get a real good nozzle check. Setup, maintenance, printhead cleaning, proceed, all colors, go for first one. Uh, it's shaking the printhead, and now it's wiping the printhead. You can see the first cleaning only did the first two functions. It did not suck ink, so those tubes still empty. Now let's do the second one. Uh, still not sucking. Okay, finally get some colors. Uh, you can see the printer not always run the sucking function when they do the cleaning. So you have to cross your fingers, hope it, it does it. You can see there's still some air bubbles in the tube. So probably we're not going to get a good uh, uh, nozzle check. Uh, remember the air bubbles in the magenta color? So now you can see that the magenta still need uh, sucking.
you thought it was going to be easy, didn't you? Actually, I didn't do any sucking this time either. I just leave the magenta box just to make sure that the ink flow direction is correct. I didn't, I did not install it backwards. So you can see it's a flow from the smaller tube to the larger tube. So, um, so we put, I put it back, just keep it clean. Almost there. Guys, it, it takes about eight cleanings. Uh, eight cleanings. I'm going to clean uh, one once more. Uh, this is when it seems you're making things worse. Mm. Don't worry, just keep going. Okay, 11 times is a charm, perfect. Uh, so next thing you'll do is just keep printing a page every day and uh, uh, at least print a page every day. So just maintain this printer and uh, you, shouldn't, you shouldn't be doing so much cleaning. Okay, now it's time to enjoy. I hope you enjoyed this video. Visit us at www.bchtechnologies.com or locally at Greensboro, North Carolina. Cheers!